Hello, good day, everybody. I'm your host, Club Brother, host of Club Sports, but I am coming to you live right here at least from Virginia Lowe and County area. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to get you guys the fact of, of Julio Jones going to the Bucks. By the way, I addressed that yesterday. I'll get you guys into the breaking news of where WrestleMania 40 is going to be. That's the big milestone, but WrestleMania 40 is going to be, and I'll tell you where that's going to be. And that, that's going to be 2024, by the way, guys. Sean Avery and uh, Hillary Rowe, they're, they're done for, and they've gone their separate ways. Jim Carl Stan's going to be in the 10-day IL with the left Achilles tendonitis injury. Chai Eng 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 Engelin is going to be um, she's a shoot shooting, shooting guru, by the way. He's going to be hired as OKC um, assistant coach. Junior's got positive photos to mark by little people. I'll tell you what that is. And Kevin Hart reacts to Channing Crowder's appreciate being in their newest colony. That's I don't know what I don't know what to think about that. BG says the rights weren't explained when she got detained in Ru Moscow, Russia. So that's all, there, that's all there's for that. Eli Manning beats um, Archie Manning in juggling. That's very interesting. You need to know that, buddy. All right, so first, I'm going to something with the, of the news from yesterday that Julio Jones is going to the Bucks on a one-year offer. Let me tell you this, though. When Julio Jones was with the Falcons, when, when Tom Brady was with the Patriots back then, I think it's like Super Bowl 51 or 52 of that, as I remember. Falcons, they destroyed the Patriots, but the Patriots, they came back by a 25-point lead. And that's how it all happened there. So then, years later, Tom Brady gives an invite to Leo Jones, despite the fact that Rob Gronk, the Gronkinator, is done. And he's retired, by the way. So now I got Big Bad Brady, or should I say... No good, Brady, by the way. Decided to call up, call up another arsenal of his, a new arsenal, in Julio Jones. Brady was the one that paid Julio Jones. That's what he did. And he's going to contend on getting back to get his eighth brass ring. Be honest, that's just not going to happen. Now, that's a good duo, by the way. But there's no way in hell that's ever going to happen. No, absolutely no way. So, Brady, if, Julio, if you think that Julio Jones is going to save you and try to get you back to brass, to, to title town, you better think again. Because by the end of the day, Brady, you're going to get what's coming to you. Congrats, Julio Jones, on going to the Bucks. But you may, but it may, you may make, but that's going to be your biggest mistake you're ever going to make. And Brady, you're going to make, you made the biggest mistake in your life when you came out of retirement. Even though you should have stayed retired. So, Brady, that's on you. This is all on you, Brady. You're going to be 45 next month. Your, your big milestone. Oh my, sorry about that. Big milestone. And you're going to enter your Jordan season, which is going to be your final season. So if you think you have any, you have the chance to even think about getting, get, being all air Brady and getting that eighth brass ring, think again. Because we all know it's never going to happen. We all know that's not going to happen. Not now. Not ever. Not, next, not in the upcoming season. Not now. Not ever. We all know that, everybody. So... Have fun, Hulu Jones. Have fun with that. That's everything there's you got to know, everybody. Also, some other news I want to get you guys into, by the way. Some And breaking news here, guys, that um, WrestleMania 40 is going to be heading back to the city of brotherly love in Philly. Yes, April 6th and 7th, 2024. That, that is a huge milestone. It's going to be Lincoln Financial Field, by the way. Since Yeah, it's all since, since Stone Cold took out The Rock and won the WWE title, by the way. We all remember that. There's a, lot, there's a lot of history in, in the Sydney Bradley Love, by the way. You have 2300 Arena, ECW. You also got the Eagles getting, getting a Super Bowl win, Super Bowl win, walking out Super Bowl champs. Sixers, the Flyers, Phillies. So, yep. A lot of history there, though. So, yes, guys. WrestleMania 40 is coming back in 2024. To the city of brotherly love in Philly, April 6th and April 7th. Mark that down on your calendars if you have not yet done so, guys. So, guys, that's huge, though, guys. I know WrestleMania 39 is going to be in, back in Hollywood. WrestleMania 40 in 2024 goes back to Philly, the city of brotherly love. We all know that, guys. There's a lot of history there. So, it's everything there's you got to know, everybody. So, that's that's the best news yet there. It was just announced earlier today. So, that's all I guys need to know. Also, another news here that um, 
Sean Avery and Hillary Rhoda, they are done for and they've gone several ways, by the way. That's all that you need to know on that. Another news here that um, Giancarlo Stan is on a 10-day IL with left Achilles tendonitis injury. Not looking good there. Another news here that um, Chip Engelin is going to be shooting. He's a shooting guru, by the way, and shooting coach. He's going to be the he's going to be hired as OKC Thunder assistant coach. Big congrats to him on that. And also, guys, another news here. Jerry Jones made himself look like a piece of trash when he had to apologize for to little, to the little people of America for using the M word. He made a heinous remark while you know making a joke to the media at the Cowboys training facility, at Cowboys training camp, while talking about Larry L Lacewell, who died at 85 in May. By the way, Jones said he he wanted he wanted to have have to address. Uh, he went to have a, a an M dressed like Lacewell and stand next to him out at practice. Clearly, you know something, Jerry Jones? You're trash. So, since you apologize for using the M, I mean, sure, there's midget wrestling, by the way. We all know that. We sure there's a lot of people who know midget, there's midget wrestling. But clearly, use that word that should not be said. I mean, you have said the little people, too. Like, clearly... Jerry Jones, you should be in that res in the little people wrestling facility, That's, and you should be the one getting beat down, Jerry Jones. You're, you, you, Jerry Jones, are trash. So your Cowboys, so your organization, your Cowboys, they're trash too. We saw what happened last season. The Cowboys, you're in the facility like a dumpster fire because the Cowboys, they're, they're not worth it. They're just not worth it. So Cowboy, so Jerry Jones should be ashamed of yourself. So you pathetic Cowboys. You, you, Jerry Jones, Dak Prescott, are garbage. You, Jerry Jones, garbage. Cowboys, garbage. Cowboy fans, garbage. So, because, and, and honestly, the reason why you can't win playoff games, you just can't. You can't win playoff games. You just can't do it. So, honestly, that's it for you, Cowboys. So, Jerry Jones, you're garbage. Cowboys, you fit the description too, and everyone knows that. You lost the four nines, and you guys are going to be garbage. In the upcoming season too, so, and you still won't be winning playoff games at all. Not, not, not. You guys have been the playoffs since '95 in over 27 years. The Cowboys suck. You always have, and you always will. Also, some other things I'm gonna get you into, by the way. Kevin Hart reacted to to um, Channing Crowder's um, appreciate appreciation of being in a nudist colony on the uh, on the Pivot Pivot podcast. Crowder and his wife wifey of his Asia. We're at an annual exhibition, exhibitionist trips, place where you can walk in and everyone's naked and walks. Really, really, I mean, you gotta be kidding me. A nudist colony, and you walk around there naked. Like, come on, that 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 that's that's just not right. Like, what are you doing? Like, are you serious? Walks up to the nudist colony and you're out there going all naked and stuff. Like, clearly, that, that makes no sense. Something's gotta be said about that, people. Something's gotta be said about that, because that he needs help. Really, he does. He does. So, take some Beth to Bismol way. And those other people, they need help too. Ridiculous. Or News Beach, by the way. I mean, what was it at Nudist Beach? Like, clearly, that's pathetic. Also, there's another news that um, Eli Manning beat um, Archie Manning in juggling. So, Archie Manning's trying to juggle, juggle his career in, in the college football. And he's gonna be in Texas, and he's gonna juggle his career in the. Um, Probably was the future NFL draft pick, by the way. So, wow. It says a lot there. That says a lot there. So, let me know about that, but I would definitely just sponsor that. That's some um, everything you got to know. So, wow. Look at that. Another news here that um, Live Golf is going to be doing four tournaments with four with 400, 405 mil total purses for 20, competing for 255 mil in 2023. Whoa, that's some right there. So, um, that's when that's when you got know over you know, somewhere over eight events this year, wow. So PGA and Liv and Liv Gov are going at it, by the way. So I'm not sure other people are gonna react to this, how they're gonna respond. A lot of events, but those events were not announced. So that's everything that you need to know about, and that's all this I can say. Also, another this year that um this past week, Green and PD were investigating a cop putting his hands on AJ Dillon, by the way, during a Manchester City versus FC Bayern Munich. Exhibition bout in Lambeau Field. So, Adrian Dillon was trying to get onto the field, 
or trying to get to the stands, but the cops try to stop him. And then he's and, and, yeah, and you know, trying to do the Lambo leap, by the way, but a cop prevents him from doing that. So Dylan wasn't probably arrested or charged, which he was not. But the cops, are, but Green Bay PD's looking into the incident. I can tell you that though. And honestly, um, it don't look good there. So that's everything there's you gotta know on that. So, and there can be some, more, and there can, there can, that cop should be probably released. That's all there's you tell about that. Also, another thing someone gets you guys into, by the way, that um, let's see, BG, you know, Brittany Griner says her rights weren't explained, uh, translated when she was got detained in Moscow, Russia, over um, hashish oil and vape cartridges she was charged with for for sure. Because they, you know, they're illegal in, Mo in in Russia, Moscow airport. She got an explanation of her rights, no access to a lawyer during the hours of her um, being behind bars. Now she used a trans translator app on her phone, figuring out what she was um, informed about. And um, honestly, it didn't look too it didn't uh, look too good. So if she's convicted of these charges, she gets sentenced behind bars. That's that's not gonna look good there. I'm honestly hoping that BG gets out, of, gets out of that Russian jail, and sent and sent back to U.S. turf. That's what everybody wants. That's what everybody wants. So that's what there's need to everybody, and that's all this I could say. And, and they gotta keep it till mid December. That, that that's not right. BG needs to, he needs she she needs to be in U, U.S. Like it's only been 140 plus days. I mean, clearly something's gotta be said about that. So let me let me know what your comments are about. And you always use hashtag free BJ, everybody. Please be sure you do some that. That's everything that you need to know. And also, this news. Last night on NXT 2.0, you saw Medusa Kemp come out. This saw the Corey J did the, did the Medusa or the Alundra Blaze last week. You know, put the NXT Women's Tag Team title in the trash. But then Medusa comes out last night, by the way. She brings the trash can over and she gets to Roxanne. Roxanne Perez, who had turned turn from attack from Core Jade, Roxanne Perez on the other side, she would she would get the, the NXT Women's Tag Team title out of the trash. And next week, there's going to be a fatal four-way match for the NXT Women's Tag Team titles next week, guys. So, must see, must watch. You'll see Ivy Nile and Tana Paxley. Valentina Faraz and her partner. You'll see Caden Carter and uh, Chance. You'll also be seeing. Um, so, so you'll see them as well. And also, you'll see Toxic Attraction too, by the way. So that's one of the things that you gotta know. That. So, will Toxic Attraction become three time NXT Women's Tag Team Champs? Will it be Caden Carter and Chance? Will it be Ivan and Tana Paxley? Or will it be Valentina Faraz and her partner? So, let me know about that, everybody. You'll stay tuned for that next week. Check that out. Also, guys, know there's an NXT Hate Wave is going to be in three weeks from now. You'll see um, Manny Rose defend the NXT Women's title against Zoe Stark. You'll see um, Braun Breaker defend the NXT title against JD McDonough, by the way. And that's and many others come, by the way, guys. So that's also for that. And also next week, you'll see a street, a false can anywhere match between Von Wagner and Solo Sokoa. That will that will be good. That is going to be a must-see, guys. Check that out. Also, some other news I want to get you guys into, by the way. Um, I want to send brother. Also, guys, the, sorry, this this news here. Jackie Robinson Museum is going to be opening in Manhattan after 14 years playing. So that's the, that's the best to get there. Wow, look, look at that. Also, another news here that um, I want to send brother wishes out to Maya Rudolph, Triple H, Taylor Schilling, Christopher, Christopher Deer, by the way, Peggy Fla Flaring, Flaring Jenkins. A Rod, Tory Lanez, Winnie Harlow, Lay Young, Dolph, Dolph Ziggler, Donnie Yen, Jordan Speed, Critty, Sanan, Beth Rowe, Indiana Evans, Alana Hadid, Mackenzie Altis, Savannah Spring, Mad Max Scherzer, Guab Dead, 4000, Gonna Chloe Hewitt, Naomi Jeans, Sherry Silver, Charlotte, Arnold, Tiffany Tynes, Easy Mill, and Eodor Giorvin. So send out your birthday wishes, shout outs. Tweet about people, please be sure you do some that. That's in there's you so that's all I can say everybody. So check that out guys, that's all this you gotta know. So best is yet there and that's all this you gotta know everybody.
Well, that's just that will, that will do right there for the Clue Level Sports Report. Please be sure you also subscribe to the Clue Level Sports Report YouTube channel, Facebook page by any, you know, I minister. Mean, so what are your thoughts on your sponsor, Julio Jones, getting a, um, get, you know, pay, it's, what are your thoughts on Julio Jones going to the Bucks, by the way? Well, after there was Tom Brady, the accused, and no good QB, who should have stayed retired by the accused go, who should have stayed retired, is with the Bucks. Let me know about that. What are the chances, what are the chances, by the way, of Julio Jones? Getting TB12 back to the promised land, back to Title 10. Let me know about that. And can they get titles together? Let me know about that. I will address the response to that. Which we all know is not going to happen. We all know that. Because Tom Brady's going to be done for at the end of the day. We all know that. Also, what are your thoughts on um, WrestleMania 40 in 2024? Coming back to the city of brotherly love in Philly, by the way. April 6th and 7th. Let me know about that. I will address the response. There's a lot of history, too, by the way. Let me know about that. Same thoughts about that Gene Carlos Sands used to play on the 10-day IL with the left Achilles 10 to 9 injury. So same thoughts praise out to him. And C Man's be sure to do so on that. Yeah, this is Jerry Jones looking like a piece of trash, by the way. He has apologized for using the M word towards the little people of America. Let me know about that. Or the LPA in that matter. And Jerry Jones is trash, and the Cowboys, they're trash to it. So are the fans, so are the organization, they're all trash. Let me know about that. I'll just find the shirt sure, buddy. This is Kevin, Kevin I reacted to um Channing Crowder appreciates of being in a nudist colony. With his wife of his Asia, go to annual exhibition, exhibition this trip. Let me know, but what are your thoughts about that? I'll just respond to that. That's some everything you gotta know on that. Thoughts on, thoughts on BG saying that her rights were weren't explained enough, but she was trying to translate. Let me know about that. I'll address this one there, but that's all the news you need to know. It doesn't Eli Manning beating uh, Archie Manning and um and uh, juggling. Let me know about that. I'll just respond to sure, buddy. Also got to send your brother wishes up to um, Maya Rudolph, Triple H, Dolph Ziggler. Y Lay Young Dolph, Donnie Yen, Jordan Speed, Critty, Sennon, Peggy, Flaring, Jenkins, A Rod, Toy Lanes, Winnie Harlow, Christopher Deer, Taylor Schilling, Guap Dad 4000, Chloe Hewitt, Naomi Jeans, Sherry Silver, Charlotte Arnold, Tiffany Times, Easy Mill, Edor Giorvin. So, so my brother wishes to tweet some people. You should just snap. That's all the news you need to know. That's all like I said, bang. And I'm back for a breaking news from Times 11. Thanks so much. So much. A whole lot more than the clue that sports with any sports later. And everything's going to Oh, don't forget, guys, SummerSlam is this coming Saturday. Music City SummerSlam this coming Saturday, guys. Don't miss it. Must see, must watch. It'll be live on Peacock TV, guys. Check it out, guys. This Saturday. Don't miss it, guys. So take care, you guys. You guys have a good day. Please be safe with that. Bye bye.